Hello everybody and welcome to Ancient Architects. Please subscribe now to get the latest ancient history news and independent research from around the world. Dr Mustafa Waziri, the Secretary General of the Egyptian Supreme Council of Antiquities, has announced the discovery of an ancient fortress that dates back to the 26th dynasty in the Sinai region of Egypt. The site is known as Tel Al Kadwa in the Sinai Peninsula, a strategic position to defend Egypt from potential enemies. It was a frontier area where the pharaoh's army could halt an enemy invasion from the east, and that is why they built an ancient fortress in this region. Sources say there has been a defence network at Sinai since at least the Middle Kingdom of Egyptian history. The new discovery which consists of two towers and a wall of a castle or fortress is interpreted as Egypt's eastern gate. The archaeological site extends for 240 feet on a raised area of ground and experts believe that originally it had 16 mud brick towers in total. The fort had many rooms that were filled with debris, earth and sand, which may have been deliberate to reinforce them. There is also the suggestion that they may have been used to store water. As reported in the Luxor Times, the entrance into the fort was also discovered, which was a gate in the northeastern part of the wall. There was also a chamber near the entrance, which was probably manned in antiquity, to monitor who was coming and going. Finds at the site include a number of spearheads, and there were more discoveries in the mud brick houses that were built against one of the fort's curtain walls, one of which was a quartz amulet inscribed with the name of a 26th dynasty pharaoh, which helped the experts date the structure. The pharaoh in question was King Smatik I of the Sate dynasty, who interestingly was the last native-born pharaoh of Egypt. The Sate period is less well known than the enigmatic Old Kingdom Pyramid Age or the splendour and majesty of the New Kingdom, but it is a very interesting and unsettling time in Egyptian history. The Sate pharaohs originated from the city of Sais and they rose to power after the Assyrian invasion of Egypt. The pharaoh identified at the fort, Smatik I, was responsible for overthrowing and banishing the Assyrian invaders and he made Egypt independent again in the year 610 BC. But another invasion, this time by the Persians, ended the Sate period in the year 525 BC. The new discovery was found to have far more ancient foundations, and speaking to the Luxor Times, Nadia Kader, head of the Department of Lower Egypt Antiquities, said, The walls of the old castle were near 7 metres in width, compared with the 11 metre wide walls of the more recent one. The original castle was also much smaller, having just 4 towers, compared to the 16 from the Sate period. Although arguably less exciting than an Old Kingdom tomb or a cache of mummies, this discovery will help archaeologists understand how Egyptian castles evolved and how the ancient Egyptians defended their homeland from foreign threats. We already know that this castle did come under siege a number of times, and in the end the walls were destroyed, probably from the later Persian invasion that finally ended the Sate dynasty. Excavations at the site are continuing, and the authorities hope that the new discovery will bring tourists into the Sinai region. Thank you very much for watching this news update from Ancient Architects. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the channel, please like the video, and please leave a comment below. Thank you very much.